Hey guys, it's Marla and welcome back to my channel and if you're new here, subscribe. Today's video is going to be how to achieve faux freckles. I think freckles are the awesomest thing in the world and if you guys have them, wow, I'm jealous. I love them and this is how I achieve my faux freckles. Without further ado, let's get into the video. So to start off this faux freckles, you are going to need just a few products. The product you're going to need is watercolor paint that is non-toxic and safe and won't kill you. You need some water, a paper plate, and a toothbrush. So I did see this method already on YouTube and I wanted to try it out. We'll have the video that we got inspired by in the link down below. So to start it off, you're going to need your paper plate. I already used it so there's some stuff on it. I'm taking my watercolor non-toxic paint and this is in the color burnt umber. I think it looks the most natural brown out of all the shades that I own. Then I have a new toothbrush that I've used for this already. Um, do not use this toothbrush on your teeth anymore right after using this. And then I'm going to be using just some of this spray bottle that has rose water in it, but you can just use regular water. So to start it off, I'm taking just a very small amount of my paint and make sure it, ha it does have to be watercolor it because it's if it's too thick, it won't work. And I'm going to be putting just a very small amount. I'm just going to be putting a very small amount, like that much. Not even, not too much because a little does go a long way with watercolor paint. After doing that, I'm going to take my toothbrush and I'm going to spray it like four times with my water. It's rose water, but you know, just use regular water. Just so it's wet. And then I'm going to go in and dilute my paint. Okay, so like I said, a little does go a long way because now I have all this stuff. Anyway, so now I'm going to uh, take my toothbrush and I'm going to put it into the the, di the mixture that we just made. And then you're going to flick that onto your face. And before I get started, I am going to say this is completely just personal preference. If you just want a few freckles, then don't do too much. And if you want a lot, then you can do as much as you want just all over your face. I'm going to focus on this area and a little bit on my forehead and a little bit on my chin. That is my dream. So you guys can stop right now if you just want a few freckles, but I'm gonna go all out and I'm gonna have a lot, so So a little it got a little crazy on the side of my nose, so I'm probably gonna go on with the cutest and up, but for the most part, I think this is as many freckles as I want. So yeah. So I'm gonna go in, put on some mascara, and then I'll be back. So this is what the completed look looks. If you guys do try this out, it obviously will look different because it will look different. So you can always add more or add less or, but basically this is how to achieve the faux freckle look. I think freckles are so cute. And if you guys have them naturally, then I'm so jealous. I think they're so cute. I've always just have, you know, I think freckles are just add to the face. Remember to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up. I love you guys and thank you guys so much for watching. Bye.